right, so this is one we used a lot in the police department, um, but it's a similar concept that we do in special operations, and that's adding pressure, one through heart rate uh, getting up, but also through competition. So we want adrenaline pumping, and the way to replicate that typically uh, is competition. So this drill is gonna be, um, got two barrels. You can only take one shot per barrel at one of the stars. So if you miss, you still have to run down to the other barrel and take your next shot. Whether you hit or miss, you can't take another shot until you get to the opposite barrel. So you'll be being timed and it'll be a competition, uh, me versus you. I like that. Okay. So it'll be, you'll say go. You'll have to be in front of the barrel. Boom, hit or miss, run to the other barrel, one shot. Other barrel, one shot. And you're running back and forth until you've knocked down all your pies. Good. All right, it's gonna be a timed event. Uh, and when I say go, you can be in. Ready, go. 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 Hit it, but it didn't fall. Yeah. Go. <laughs> Time. That's why we do that. So if you saw before, he had no issues shooting that Texas star down at all. So he knows he could shoot. We know he could shoot. But that's what you need to do if you want to really ramp things up is you add competition and you add a heart rate. So every time you miss and you're running, you're starting to get in your own head. You're starting to psych yourself out. You're starting to feel the pressure um, and that really adds. So special operations use competition and heart rate all the time. So I'm gonna give a run at it and see how I do. And I've done this with bowling pins and I've my shooting has gone to shit when I really, really wanna win. Um, so that's a great thing about doing it this way. So I got a wrench thrown in, he took my pistol which is uh, quite, quite nice, my pistol. <laughs> I shoot quite well with, I shoot quite, quite well with that beauty. Um, so, but no excuse, uh, let's do this. Uh, hold on, time. One minute 45. I miss my Crimson Trace Red Dot very much. Heart rate competition. I could hit that thing like that, you know, without my heart rate up and without my without the competition. But you add that stuff, you really gotta learn how to slow down, calm down, 
and not let the pressure get to you. That was fun. All right, guys. So we're gonna I'm gonna run that back real quick, and we're gonna run it this time with uh, optics and different pistol setups. So I'm an optic lover, uh, and so hopefully that changes the game a little bit. Let's run that again and see if the optic changes anything for me. Time. Nice. There she is. There it is. Oh, this might this is gonna be a tough competition now. <laughs> there it is. Woo! Time. 59 right. seconds. 59 seconds. All right. Now we got a competition. See, now I'm actually I'm feeling the pressure now. Okay. I'm feeling good. it. Time. Oh. Optics not the key. Slow it down. All right. Ten seconds. Dick. Oh, I beat you by two seconds. Nice. Nah, I like yeah. that. That was one fun. minute. <laughs> one minute exactly. You start to feel the pressure. As soon as you stop, instead of taking your time, you just want to get running. You got to catch the breath. That's yeah, what I uh, learned today. Just catching the breath. Yeah, take your time and slow pull it. The competition just pulls you in. Oh, that was fun. All right, guys. So that was it. Our fun range day with Prime Armor. What an awesome plate carry, I love it. Uh, as you can see, the plates perform. Whew, I'm tired. And we did some shooting drills. The best way to end the day, adding some competition and getting our heart rates up. That was awesome. No ego, just trying to get better at shooting and improving our craft. Blake, uh, great plate carrier. Thanks for having me out, man. That was awesome, I appreciate you. My pleasure, man.